guys, welcome back to another video. So the market is down as you guys can see. Uh, now it's a great time to actually start buying many of these companies that uh, you know were on pretty much uh, all time highs at one point not too long ago. And uh, some of my favorite personal companies would be Microsoft, Nike, Wind, AMD, um, Boeing is another one. And uh, today I actually ended up buying some uh, Wind uh, stock. Now this one has to do with all the casinos and it's pretty much gotten beat down all the way to around $55 currently. Now back then when I was trading this, uh, it was right around the uh, $140 five dollar average price and uh, just along with the whole market it's just you know came tumbling down and I actually just got into it today uh, I ended up buying a hundred shares of it that's roughly around a little over five thousand dollars that I just uh, invested in wind and uh, the first thing that I'm actually gonna do uh, now normally what I tend to do is sell puts when I'm trying to buy an option I'm, I'm sorry a stock but in this case I just bought them flat out I thought it was a good price I did miss out on this uh, dip right here right when it was at uh, forty eight dollars then you know I would have made some capital gains by now 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 that I have a hundred shares of uh, wind I have them with an average price of fifty four dollars and ninety four cents now what I'm gonna go ahead and do is go ahead and trade some options basically when I say trade options is you know deal with options but sell a covered call because I have a hundred shares of the stock so again if you watched all my other videos I'm gonna use the hundred shares that I have right now and use them as collateral to give somebody else the right to take the shares away from me at a price point that I choose and I'm gonna do this here on a TD Ameritrade Think or Swim platform. Now this is completely free. You guys can sign up for TD Ameritrade. You don't have to uh, have a minimum balance, and it's all completely free. Same with the platform. And uh, I'm gonna go and show you how easy this is on you know writing covered calls if you're into you know little safer trades rather than buying puts and buying calls. So I'm here in the options chain, and I'm only gonna use you know selling a covered call with a three day expiration so these options right here they expire in three days which is March 20th so remember we bought these shares at fifty four dollars and ninety four cents if I want to give somebody else the right to buy them from me almost around the same price kind of you know buying in and buying myself back out uh, I would sell them off at fifty five dollars and I'm okay with that there's really not much capital gains but the premium on this is pretty nice so I'm gonna go ahead and sell a covered call so I'm gonna get anything between five hundred and five hundred and thirty dollars so let's max it out just to do it see if we can get filled so we're gonna get credited basically make five hundred and twenty nine dollars right now you ready watch this now we just gotta <laughs> wait to get filled basically because uh, we put the uh, ask on the uh, highest one but since it's trending down let's go ahead and cancel that order we're gonna ask for a little bit less all right I'm just doing this just to show you guys how simple writing cover calls is we're gonna sell one let's ask for 500 somewhere in the middle five hundred and twenty dollars just to get filled there you go we just made five hundred and twenty dollars so if you guys have been following me on my channel please uh, subscribe like and share uh, I'm very happy on doing these kind of videos for you guys and as far as the Robin Hood video that I've been um, you know doing a series on I'm still gonna continue that at the moment I'm down to around three hundred dollars I have an Apple call with an expiration date of March 20th 27th I'm sorry and then I sold a put a Neo I got assigned and then I sold a covered call so now writing covered calls is a little bit slower than just buying options and buying puts I'm the seller on that end so as of currently that's where I'm at with the uh, Robin Hood account and I wanted to make this video real quick uh, you know and let you guys know that all this is just like going back in time and buying the stocks at a cheaper price the ones that you were saying hey you know I should have bought it back when it was 
at this price so market crashes are not really you know bad news most of the people that you know invest in market crashes those are the people that get rich they buy very very cheap and then at a later point it just hold it for the long term and that's how they get rich that's just of course my opinion if you guys have any other um opinions any ideas on future videos or if you guys want to leave a list on uh, stocks that you're trading currently just leave them in the uh, comment section down below and i'll be more than happy to reply until then i'll see you guys on the next video